Griffin is with us it's about racism. Buttigieg addressed the controversy during CNN's town hall event overnight. Our senior investigative correspondent, Drew Griffin, is with us. Drew, uh, we heard from Mayor Buttigieg. You've been looking into this incident as well. Yeah, it's tough for the mayor to talk about this issue because back home in South Bend, Indiana, as we found in the black community, there's always been this perception or question as to why this mayor appears to be protecting the privacy rights of white, allegedly racist cops. Shortly after Pete Buttigieg became mayor of South Bend, Indiana, he became embroiled in a controversy he still tried to explain seven years later. What are on the secret tapes regarding the demotions of South Bend's black police chief, Daryl Boykins? So the answer is I don't know. The secret tapes are phone conversations between four white officers, including a top detective, recorded by an internal police department system. The officers made derogatory racial slurs, including comments about the city's first black police chief. That's according to a lawsuit by one of the only people who's heard those recordings. Once Chief Daryl Boinkins heard about the conversations in 2011, he asked the recordings continue. Buttigieg forced him to resign because of the way the chief handled the situation, causing an uproar in a time of racial tension in South Bend and across the country. The Trayvon Martin situation had just happened in February. Chief Boykin's situation happens in, I believe, March of that same year, 2012. And our nation is infuriated. Our city, the people in our city, especially African Americans, are infuriated. It just raised a lot of questions and uh, I think as well created some mistrust um, behind a lot of different things happening at the same time. Well, judge later rehired, then demoted the chief. The controversy led to an extremely complicated chain of lawsuits that have gone on for years.